Hey to everyone, today I'm gonna be doing press on nails and I wanna show you most of the items I use, including nail files, nail tip cutter, I use buffers as well, and of course nail tips. I have a whole bunch from Beatles, Model 1s, they are coffin shapes, all these nails. These ones are from my car. And these ones are from Chi and I like it when they come in this box because you can see the numbers outside. It make it easier to reach the nail tip that you need. As well, I want to show you a couple of uh, other nail tips that I purchased on Chi and on Amazon. These ones are all moon shape. They are the 100 nails in here for $1, which is not a bad deal. <laughs> and these ones are a double XL from Amazon. These ones are a lot of fun to design. <laughs> As well, nail stands. I like these ones because you can detach the nails from the base. And I use as well alcohol and acetone, alcohol to clean the lines and acetone to clean the brushes. If you are using gel polish, you need a LED UV lamp. This one has a detachable button and it has four different settings. It has 60 seconds, 30 seconds, 10 seconds, and it has a slow cure setting. And as you can see, it has a sensor when you put your hand in there and it has a large space for the nails. As well, I have some decoration that I use. This is not everything that I have. I'm just very uh, unorganized person. <laughs> These are just few of the items that I could gather. Stickers, glitter, rhinestones. I have a nail art palette. And of course, I have gel polishes. I have base top, top coats, matte and shiny, and I have some dipping powders as well. Okay, now I'm jumping into the nails that I'm creating today. This is a friend request, and I'm gonna be trying the sweater nail design. This is the first time I'm gonna be trying this. <laughs> so let's hope for the best. And I'm starting with the base coat from Model Ones and cure it for 30 seconds. I just realized that I made a boo-boo here. This nail is supposed to be red, so I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe it with alcohol <laughs> and start over with this nail. create a French in this nail and today I'm not using any technique <laughs> this is completely freehand here <laughs>
and adding a matte top coat because it's easier to draw the nail art on a matte surface.
and this is the final result everyone i left some nails glossy and the sweater ones are matte i'm very happy with the results today i think they look very cute <laughs> Thank you so much for watching my video and being here. It means a lot to me. <laughs> I'm very new to YouTube and just seeing that some of you are subscribing, that makes my day completely. 